Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. As always, today we're going to show you how to create a custom barcode in Microsoft Word or even WordPad, which comes with Windows. You only need to know two things, get the font and how to type it. Let me show you. It's not too tough. What we're going to do first is we're going to download a barcode font. I spent hours playing with these different fonts, different styles, bigger, smaller. One of them had 39 files in it. 39 files. It's one file. It's a font. So I made the file available, the Code39 font. Click this link right here. Check the video description or look up here for the little I and you can follow through to Major Geeks to follow along with this tutorial at home. All right. So we're going to get the font. You're going to extract it to a folder. And you can either double click it and click install or right click and choose install or install for all users. I'm going to click install and you just wait a minute. And while we're here, I'm going to discuss this real quick. You need to know the font name. It's easier. So we're looking for F. Actually, the easiest way to do it is start typing it in. Just so you know. There it is right there. It says free three of nine. If you click on that and you change your mind later, you don't want to do this, or you just want to get the font off your machine, that is where you uninstall it. Piece of cake. You can also change the default font size while you're here. But I digress, as they say. All right, so fonts installed. We know the name of the font, so we're going to start either Microsoft Word, if you have Office installed, or WordPad. So let's go start. And I have Office here, as you can see, but I'm going to use WordPad because everybody has that. Let's see if I can do this the right time. Windows Accessories. Yay, look at me. WordPad. All right. What we want to do is you want to type whatever you want in the barcode. So let's say I want to do majorgeeks.com. You're going to put an asterisk on either side. So start with the asterisk. Oh, I can't forget the S. I don't think it matters. M-A-J-O-R-geeks.com. And end with an asterisk. Now we're going to change the font. What we're going to do is we're going to highlight whatever you typed in, including the asterisk, just like that. If you don't know how to do that, hold your left button down, hold it down while you drag it across, and let go. Then we go in here, and once again, you can start typing FRE. And you see it comes right up unless you have a bunch of other fonts that start with FRE, which you probably don't. And actually, you can just cheat and hit enter. And there's my barcode. There's my barcode. Any size you want. Pretty neat, right? And there's your barcode. And you can save it, scan it. Do whatever you want with it. Piece of cake. And there you have it. So step by step, that should get you through it pretty quick. Really easy to do. Took me longer to write the article by far than it does to actually do it. So grab the font. Don't forget the asterisks. Type what you want. Change the font. That's it. All right. Give it a try. Let me know how you made out. Bottom right hand corner, subscribe button. Click like at least if we helped you out, would you? And thanks for watching as always. See ya.